Despite this, the door handle does not move when you try to turn it. Sports, sports, sports. These guys look like they're talking about sports. I can't believe that. She has some- no Oh, no, that's cheating. My bad. Thank you so much for your- What do you want? Not a problem, dawg. Give your hand over here and I'll just chop it off. <laughs> what? Again? Man, you just take my money, damn it. Huh. How much money I have? 1,335, baby. That's what I'm talking about. It's stuck. Stuck? No. Who told you to put it on? Oh, oh my, my goodness, goodness Mary, for the love of Welcome back to Time Masquerader. Hi, if you're new here, my name is Para, your host, and today we're going to continue playing Blackout Hospital. Now, while I was away, I also played like an extra 20 or 30 minutes just farming this place and just killing the monsters over and over and over again. Now, both Vasilis and Mary are in level 7, Baby, which is great. For. Let's go to the 6th floor. And... Ah! Okay. <gasps> yes! Okay. The sustenance has been cut down. The axe breaks. What? Come on! One time use axe? The hell? Stupid rusted piece of- <laughs> Well, at least we still got something out of it. I guess. Whatever, let's go. Whoa, seven! I'm so excited. <gasps> Wait, is that the notes that Rune was talking about? There's a note on the ground. Wait, can I read it with you this time? Uh, who should I read it in? Vasilis or Mary's voice? When the flowers first bloom in the springtime, my love did too. I never expected to fall in love again, especially not the way I did. But how could I resist her? Her coral-colored locks, the way she twirled the end of her dress when she was happy. My chest swirled with feelings I didn't know were possible. I thought I had felt love before, but it wasn't like this. It was never like this. Every new flower, every tripping bird, every sunny day, they all reminded me of her. She, her whole self, was prettier than any flower, cheerier than any bird song, and warmer than any sunny day. She is the springtime, only better. What? Ew, what the hell is this? I think it's a love letter, Vasilis. Nobody panic. What do you mean? No. Is this not the most grossy, cheesy thing you've ever read in your entire life? Oh, I think it's sweet. Yeah, whatever. What's it doing here, though? Okay. What is this convenient block of light? What am I looking at? Whoa. Huh? A, a flower shop? Well, this is, um, different. Uh, yeah. Different is a word for it, I guess. Yeah, sure. It's also why... Well, why in the seventh floor, though? Shouldn't it be, like, in the lobby? Yeah, these are just normal-looking plants. Hello. <laughs> Hello, my name is Drekride. How can I help you today? Oh? oh, uh, nice to meet you. I, um, I like your horns. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I like yours as well. Uh, hi. Um, where the beep did all this come from? I'm afraid I don't understand what you mean. This, we're in a hospital still, right? Um, no. This is the flower shop on the corner of the third street. Do you need a hospital? Okay, dude, I'm not delusional, okay? You're delusional. I can call a taxi for you if you'd like. Uh -huh. I what? Never mind, we're fine. Uh, we don't need a hospital. If you're sure? While we're here, can I interest you in one of our special bouquets? Uh, I don't know, I mean... Actually, wait, how much money do I have on me anyways? Not that I'm going to buy it, but if I did... How many flowers would this get me? Oh my gosh, I was farming the entire time. I have like 1,000 and something dollars. Not to brag or anything, but you know. Oh, this is... Sorry. I'm sorry. I can't say I recognize what kind of currency this is. You can't? You folk must not be from around here. No, you're not from around here, buddy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't give you anything without proper payment. But if you exchange some currency later, feel free to stop by and buy something, all right? All right. Okay, so I guess I can't do anything here for now. It appears to be the front door of the shop, outside at least to a sunny street. Despite this, the door handle does not move when you try to turn it. No, my freedom! No prices are listed. Dude, how do I know? Anyway, wait, wait, I want to show you guys. Look at how much money I have. 1,335, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, see you. I'll be back with the currency, I guess. Wait, do these do anything? No, I don't think they all do anything. I have to get back with money. Okay. Well, this one's locked. Is it the ones with the lights over it? Whoa! Huh? 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 Whoa, 
It's like a whole restaurant in here. How the? What? Dude, you're back again? Hi! Oh. Ah, waiter. Huh? My fiance is in the restroom right now. But could I request you refill her drink for her? Thanks. Thank you so much. I'm not a, I'm not a waiter, but okay. I'm a janitor, but okay. No problemo. I don't have anything for your wife's fiance. Wait, was that your letter? What is your name? Decker something. Thanks. Okay. Let's talk to you. Hey, hey, stop walking. Oh, thank goodness you're here. Hello? The restaurant's packed tonight. I can't tend to all these tables by myself. You, you help me, right? Hold on, can you slow down? Come on, please. Uh, you can take all the tips. I don't care. Just help me out. You'll help me, right? Yeah, I will, because if I get paid in your money, then I can pay this guy. Oh, thank gosh. Here, take this dish. Deliver it to the gents talking about sports over there. Appetizer. I should have another dish for you to deliver by the time you do that. Thank you so much for your help. Sports, sports, sports. These guys look like they're talking about sports. I can't believe that. She has some... Oh, no, that's cheating. My bad. The food is always wonderful. Thank you. Um... Our appetizer's here. Thank you, kindly. You're welcome. Alright, so you guys are talking about... Bribery. New Year resolution. Oh, debt. Okay. Cake is here. Looks really good. Food is here. Is wonderful. Oh, okay, okay. I think I have everyone's tables aligned. Give me the next one. It's delivered to the table with three people. Oh! <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, you, you should have just told me that last time. Just deliver it to the second table in the place. Here you go. Oh, there it is. Thank you. All right. Next. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Ready. <laughs> Stop moving so much. Damn it. All right. You got only one last table to take care of. Dessert. I'll be honest, I don't remember where this goes. But I'm sure you can figure it out. Thank you so much for your- What do you want? Okay, whatever. I'll give it to this guy. Oh. Oh, waiter. <laughs> no, my fiance's still in the bathroom. I thought you wanted it. Wait, cake, 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 cake. Didn't they guys were talking about cake? Yes, that cake's for us. Thank you so much. Here, take this tip. You're working so hard after all. Receive strange money. Oh, uh, thank you. I'm even dressed in, like, janitor's clothing, but sure, that's fine. Thank you for all your help earlier. Maybe, maybe they'll let us both go home early. How long have you been here? All right, right. Back to this floor. Hello, I'm here to buy flowers from future, not future you. Um... Hey, uh, we got some money now. Oh, really? Wonderful. Pass it over. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. What? Again? Man, you just take my money, damn it. Huh. What's the matter this time? This isn't going to be enough for a bouquet. No. It's not? Oh, but I feel so bad turning you away empty-handed again. Can you give me, like, one flower? One itty bitty flower? You don't gotta give me the bouquet. Here, take this. Yeah, a rose is good. I'll take a rose. I hope that makes up for things. Thank you. Thank you for your purchase. Come back again. Better than nothing, I guess. Yeah, that's good enough for me. That's good enough for me. Thank you, Jerry. I'll be back later. I don't even know. I don't remember your name. It was too complicated to pronounce. Too complicated to remember. Can I give you the rose? What? I love how we don't even question, like, oh, it's the same guy. Okay, I still can't open this one? No. Go- eh? Oh, that's a interesting hallway. Okay, can't open that. Yep. I thought it's something that only happens once, but I suppose it makes more sense that it's possible to happen again. There's no such thing as everlasting happiness, after all. Or maybe it's just that you need to properly move on from what's allowing you to stay. Let's call it... stable. But how do you move on from something like that? Surely it can be done if... The rest of the page is covered by mysterious black. Dang it. He's obviously stuck with, like, probably his love, right? <laughs> <gasps> A blue lollipop? Should I be saving these? Jeez Louise. Maybe that heals, like, a lot. I'm gonna check these doors, and then I'm gonna go to the other one. Oh. Ooh. What the hell? Whoa! I can't even see the end of it. Where are we? <laughs> There's no way this could still be the hospital, right? No, obviously not. Cake! A cake that looks like it had a few slices taken out. It's fixed in place. You can't move it when you try. It looks like any normal cake, but feels like it's made of plastic. Pitcher of water. It's fixed in place. You can't move it when you try. No, I need the water, don't I? Oh, place rose and vase? Yes. You're welcome, ghosts. You're welcome. Oh. Something about the picnic object seems to shift. Mm -hmm. Hey, I think we can pick these up now. <gasps> I need the water. Yes. You don't really need one. 
We don't really need cake right now. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I needed these, but... Oh, look, there's somebody in the distance. You don't want to walk too far away and get lost. From the door! Right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, of course. Okay, I think I know where to go with that water, but... I'm gonna check out this one. The door is locked. If you listen closely, you can hear people talking. There isn't anything else you can do? I'm sorry, we tried everything. Please, there has to be something, anything! I I'm sorry. Uh-oh, I bet you the beloved got sick. Oh. Hold on, it just lagged. I just want to make sure that it's not breaking. Hold on. Okay, well, everything seems to be fine. Just my silly paranoia, because that happened to, like, Deltarune a long, long time ago. Um, it, my computer glitched, I didn't pay attention to it, and then the entire file got its audio mixed up, so yeah. Here's, uh, here's that refill you asked for, I guess. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, this night has just been so perfect. Here, take this. You've more than earned it. Lots of strange money. Whoa, this, this seems like a lot. Oh, it's nothing compared to all your help this evening. Take it, I insist. Why, I'm even going to tell your boss how wonderful you are. Apologies, what's your name again? Uh, Vasilis? <laughs> Don't you sound unsure of yourself. I sure am. I promise, I've only got good things to say about you. Thank you so much again. Well, well, there they go. They gave us so much money. Yeah, I wonder how much this all equals anyway. But it should be enough for... A bouquet? Are we gonna buy another one? Okay, I'm gonna go back to his shop then. Hello? I got a ton of money now. Hello again. Hi, uh, can we buy a bouquet with this? You signed the strange money across the counter. Oh yes, of course. Glad you could finally get the situation settled. So, which bouquet would you like? Um, which one do you think we should get? Oh? Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh, I think the pink one is really pretty. Maybe that one? A wonderful choice. <laughs> that arrangement is my girlfriend's favorite, too. Ooh. Thank you. There you are. I... Oh, oh dear. What is it? I'm sorry, I didn't realize how late it's gotten. I've got to leave right now. I've got a very important day tonight. You don't need anything else, do you? Oh, uh, I guess not. Wonderful. I'll be taking my leave then. Have a wonderful rest of your night. Oh. Bye! And there they go again. Hey, can I see that bouquet for a second? Oh, uh, sure. Hmm. I think there's... Yeah, a key! Oh. Whoa, uh, nice catch. I don't think I would have noticed that. I guess this is for the last room. 702 key. Ah. Let me out! Okay, fine, I'll leave. He's really, uh, cocky, leaving me in here with his shop. Um, I don't really want to go down here, because I don't know what's down here, but... The door to the bridge is locked. Okay, that's good. Uh, because I wanted to just, like, focus on the rooms with the... With the sunny things in front of it. Ooh, another note. Let me guess, your girlfriend died, sadly. Okay. We'll read it together, Mary. There's notes on the floor. I wish I married you in the emergency room, instead of not at all. I wish I met you sooner, and proposed the second I did. I wish I could be happy that you no longer have to suffer. I wish I didn't have to suffer too. I wish that you'll be happy wherever you go. And I wish that when I see you there, you'll understand why I didn't want to wish anymore. Wow. Don't, don't get too hung up about this kind of stuff. Okay, you're right. <laughs> Pull it together. I'm sure she's happier outside of this place than in. There's another note anyways. I won't throw out the last of the flowers, but I don't think I'll be able to handle it if they die in my care. I'm leaving the flowers here, as much as it pains me to leave you in their care again. But maybe they'll at least be able to keep this part of you alive. Flowers, flowers. Where do we keep flowers here? There's the courtyard on the ground floor, but there's also the rooftop huh. garden. Can we even access either of those, though? I think we can access the roof, maybe. Mary, come on. I told you don't get hung up on that. Well... Sorry, I just... You're... You're right. I shouldn't get hung over it. Let's just see if this book I, we got fits anywhere. Alright, here. Here. On the bed. Okay, behind the curtains. In the windowsill. Okay, I'm going back outside. Oh! What? What was that? Where is it? Huh? Something else fell out of the bouquet. What's this? A uh, ring? Huh? 
Wait, jeez, this isn't just any ring. It's a wedding ring. Really? How do you know? Look at this. There's a diamond, a real diamond, Mary. What is this? <sighs> and you can tell? I, uh, yeah, how do you know about this? I wouldn't be able to figure it out. I know a thing or two about gems. Oh, oh, you little pickpocket. That's, <laughs> that's really cool, Vasilis. And you chose to be a janitor? Well, hey, okay. No, no, that, wait, that's not what I, I didn't mean it in that mean way. S sorry. Can I see it? Oh. The ring? Yeah. Uh, sure. You passed the ring to Mary. Diamond? Really? I don't think I've ever actually seen real. What's with the face? It's stuck! Stuck? No. Who told you to put it on? Oh my goodness, it's Mary, for the love of so, Sorry, I didn't mean to. It's just, I saw it in my hand, and it was just an instinct to try to put it on my finger. I, I wasn't thinking. Uh, yeah, I can see that. Obviously, you aren't thinking. Here, let me see. Ow, 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 stop it, that hurts! Well, Mary, what else am I supposed to do? Well... It's not too tight or anything, is it? It's just like sitting on your finger? It doesn't hurt? No, no, it's fine. Right. Right, then just keep it there for now, okay? We'll figure out how to get it off later. Uh, all right, sorry. Whatever, let's just put these flowers somewhere. Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see. Can this door open now? No. Can I... I'm gonna try the stairs later uh, in a second. Hold on. The door is locked. Okay, so I can just go straight to the... It's locked. Looks like we aren't getting through there. Just as well, I guess. The courtyard always had the most flowers. And it's what most people see. It's downstairs, right? Yeah, just before the cafeteria. I remember because I thought the lounge room was the uh, courtyard. So, let me go back to the bottom. Um? Cool, so we've practically unlocked this entire hospital now. Do, do, do. The door to the courtyard is locked. Hmm. Damn, still locked. Okay, well now what are we supposed to do? How are we supposed to get in? Vasilis, do you hear that? Uh, yeah, actually, I do. Is that coming from the cafeteria? Oh, no. Please don't tell me there's gonna be a whole mound of people in the cafeteria. Oh! Okay, hold on a sec. I didn't know we have a party going on. Let's go, Jerry! So on to some pretty nice stuff, but I don't know. He has a lot of junk, too. I don't think it's worth it. What are you talking about? Oh, sorry. I was just thinking to myself. Don't mind me. <gasps> Hello! Smacks me! All right, hold on, hold on. Oh, I gotta talk to you this time. Huh? What the? What's going on here? Who the hell are you? Who am I? Who am I? <laughs> you hear that, fellas? They don't know who I am. Ain't that rich. <laughs> Stupid idiot. Yeah, yeah, I can't even. All right, all right, all right. Let's get it out of the way. My name is Hilladrinx, Hilladrinx Vanderkarg. I deal in cards like you deal in chemicals, my janitor friend. All right, he doesn't really have a New York accent, but I was close enough. I, okay. What are you doing here? We're filling our taxes. <laughs> ha, told you. We're playing cards. No. Well, for, yeah. <sighs> but where did you come from? This place was completely empty before. How did you get in? Or uh, more importantly, do you know a way out? The way out? <laughs> You're killing me, Smalls. Okay, stop laughing at me. <laughs> You're a riot. Come sit, play around with us. Don't do it, man. I'm out of my life savings. And my death savings. Oh my goodness. Not my fault you don't know when to stop. So, wanna play? No. Uh, no thanks. We don't really have the time. And I'm not a gambler, thank you very much. Ah, oh, come on. You could win a prize. A prize? Like what? Hey, what the f- Where'd you get the courtyard keys? Yep. You want him? Then play around with us. Huh? Please, Mr. Uh, Vander Cork, you said? It could be important for us to get into the courtyard. Wah, wah, wah? What's he got there? What do you mean? Your finger. Like I could miss a gemstone that big. You married or what, toots? Oh. Oh, uh, oh no, I just- we found it, and it got stuck. <laughs> Tell you what. 
Give me that ring, and the keys are all yours. Oh, oh uh, I, I don't know. Do we have to? I think it might belong to someone. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't have to do anything. But I don't want to give you the keys either, do I? Uh, you good? Mm. You know what? Whatever. It might just be easier for everyone if we do the stupid card game. Like you said, it's probably somebody's. And it's not like we can get that ring off your finger right now anyway, so... Yo, chatter boxes. Ring for keys. We gotta deal what? I think, well, you can have it. Well... If it'll get us closer to getting out of here, well... Wonderful. Lovely, lovely, darling. But, uh, there's still the issue. I can't get it off my finger. Not a problem, though. Give your hand over here and I'll just chop it off. <laughs> Hill and Drake grabs Mary's hand and effortlessly slides the ring finger. Oh, what? How did you do that? Whoa, how did you do that? A good magician never reveals his secrets, sweetheart. But a try's a try. Here's that key. Come back to play anytime. Oh, heck yeah. What's that look for? Well, I'm just kind of curious you did that, I guess. Oh. It's, well, if we can get out into the courtyard, what else are we going to do? We want to leave, and if I held onto it, I'd be holding us back from doing that. It's just a ring, right? I just hope it finds its way back to where it belongs somehow. Mm -hmm. Eh, it probably will. Things like that usually do. Alright. Actually, I just realized something, that the game's music? is sort of louder than the people talking? Or maybe it's not. And it's just like, I hear it different than what the game. Find a way out yet? Ha! <laughs> I love the way he laughs. Here's my new little character. I don't remember his name anymore. It sets me when I can't remember names, but he's cute. I like him. He's like, Phil, Highlandrix. Highlandrix, something like that. Why am I talking to the water cooler? It doesn't matter. Is anyone inside the kitchen? Well, who are you? Uh, hello? Oh, hey! <laughs> I was starting to feel like it was just me here. Huh. Oh, what are you doing here? <laughs> Sorry, I was just so hungry. I couldn't wait around any longer. And I had a feeling that no one was going to come around and ask what I wanted right now. Hey, are you one of Ollie's friends? Huh? Huh? Ollie's here? Yeah, they said that their friends were in the hospital and that they're looking for them. Oh, shoot! Ollie, that sweetheart. <laughs> I better go look for him. I hate to keep him waiting. They can get, uh, real worried sometimes, you know? Oh. You're just gonna go off on your own? Yeah, yeah, I'll be fine. Don't sweat it. See you around. Oh, did I find one of his friends accidentally? Oh, shoot! I'm a genius! Certified genius! Seven times a week! Okay, where's the characters? Mitzi. Huh? Oh, what does that mean? I don't know what that symbol means. Oh, no, I'm not the fluent in, uh, gender. Mitzi received a broken arm from a car crash earlier in the day and is staying in the hospital overnight. She says the pain hasn't been bothering them ever since the lights went out and that they're content just waiting around as long as she can listen to her music. So there are she, them? Is that what that means? Ooh, I'm becoming very fluent, ain't I? Okay, well, I'm gonna end this episode here because I don't want it to go on for too long that it'll take me forever to edit it because I, you know, I need to do other things. So if you want to see the full playlist of Blackout Hospital, you can click on the playlist on the screen now. See you later, Masquerader.